Hello, today I would like to present you this absolutely beautiful vintage CRT computer screen that was manufactured by Polish company. At first glance, I'm pretty sure that you can make assumption that this is going to be just a regular TV set. And yes, for a fact, in exactly the same four factor, the same company was creating a normal TV that was able to receive your regular analog channels. But that model is a dedicated computer monitor. This is going to be part of a bigger retro computer project. But let's take a look what we've got. The screen we've got decent size. I would say it is not too small, not too big, very comfortable to use. On front panel, we've got absolutely basic controls. We've got a power indicator, adjustment of brightness, adjustment of contrast, and volume control. And that's because this device got a speaker. And we've got our hardware master power switch. Absolutely beautiful. No standby bullshit. You press it, it's cutting the power completely. On top and on side, we've got that thing that is wrapped around and it's simulating a high quality wood, which is sadly not the case. Carrying handle looks funny because it is quite heavy, so definitely you are not going to be walking around with that, but to just pull it out from your wardrobe, it is absolutely great. You can have it stuffed somewhere and grab and carry around your home. On that side, we've got absolutely beautiful speaker, very decent sound. Here we've got nothing, just more fake, high quality wood wrapping. On the back, we've got a cooling fins. We've got our two pots that are being used for grabbing your vertical and horizontal lock. So if you've got like a jumping screen in the vertical way, then you are going to be regulating that. If you've got a horizontal, then you are going to be using that. We've got a pretty common plug, very standardized, so you've got no problem in replacing that. You've got a fuse and computer style plug, and we've got information which one we've got what kind of signal. So for example, we've got the sync for the horizontal, sync for the vertical. This is a DE9 style plug, so you've got no problem in rigging your own cable. We've got also a composite signal input in a full-size DIN plug, and they are also labeled, so you've got no problem in rigging up your own cable. This is what mean right to repair. And here we've got information that we can expect 2KV on the flyback transformer. Here I've got cable that on one end we've got a full-size DIN plug and on other standard RCA. And we are just going to plug it in here like this. And now we are ready to put our test signal. I had to change the shutter speed. And as you can see right now, we've got absolutely beautiful picture. Just disregard those two stripes. I don't know how to get rid of them. We are hooked up to our signal generator and we can generate some sort of test pattern. So here we are going to be nicely seeing how beautiful it is. So here we've got like a full white page. Here we've got our pattern for checking out how the screen works, how the geometry is being made. And as you can see, we've got absolutely beautiful lines and the screen is really great. So you can take a look. It is absolutely beautiful vintage device. Let me go back to our stripe and here you will be able how we can change the contrast. So it looks really nice and we can adjust the brightness and it's just working great. 
So as you can see, the device is absolutely amazing. The green color give you a really nice vintage vibe and it worked really well. So thank you very much for watching. I hope you find it interesting. See you next time and bye bye.